morning, Trumbull High School. I'm Isabel Malikfor. And I'm Brady Lynch. And we're here with the morning announcements. The Trumbull Agriscience and Biotechnology Center is holding an open house for 8th grade students and their parents Thursday, November 5th at 5.30 p.m. and 7 p.m. If you know any 8th grade students from Trumbull, Bridgeport, Easton, Fairfield, Milford, Monroe, Orange, Reading, Shelton, or Stratford, please feel free to pass this information on to them. Isabel, are you going to the Italian Club meeting? Yes, I am. After school, Thursday, November 5th in the Senior Lounge. And the Robotics Club will be meeting on Thursday, November 5th in the room 825 after school. That's where the smart kids go. <laughs> okay, FYI, picture retakes will be on Wednesday, November 11th from 10 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. periods 4 through 7 in the Senior Lounge. If you do not yet have your picture taken, you must come down and take a picture. Students who would like to retake must bring their original package plus a $5 retake. <coughs> Teachers who missed the previous picture day should come down for their photos as well. Extra photo forms are available in house offices. And for all you young children, the driver education classes will begin November 30th to January 4th, 2016 from Monday to Thursday, 2.30 to 4.30 p.m. in room M45. Students must be 16 year years old to register for the class. Registration forms are available in the main office and outside the driver's ed office, opposite room A1. For additional information, please see Mr. Romano. Clubs, attention all knitters. The Binky Patrol of Mon Trumbull Monroe needs your help. We will be meeting in room C14 on Thursday, November 15th at 2.30 to knit or crochet squares and be made into blankets. We will provide the supplies. Any questions, see Ms. Bullen in room C14. The BIE Club will be holding their first meeting on Thursday, November 5th after school in the Media Center classroom. All students interested in business are welcome to attend. Today we have a special guest with us, Aaron Lara. From the boys soccer team. <laughs> welcome Aaron. Hi Aaron. How's your day? It's good. How was your day? Where'd you get that scarf? Jill. <laughs> Love it. Thank you. How's the season Any going? Questions? Oh, okay. Our season's going pretty good. We're in states. You guys excited for states? Yeah, we're pumped. I think we have a. I think we have a friendly this Friday, <laughs> and I think our first state game is Tuesday against Cheshire. Who are you guys playing in a friendly? Uh, I think it's Shelton. Oh, Shelton! I'll be there. You will. Me too. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, guys. <laughs> anyway, um, <laughs> pleasure having you, Aaron. Okay. Thanks, Aaron. Take some candy if you'd like. For the road. For the road. Thanks, guys. Have an excellent day. <laughs> Go with <this>. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Food service. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. You should always eat it. Breakfast hours are 7 to 7.15 and 7.45 to 8.20. The combo breakfast price is $2. Free or reduced price is $0.30. Cents. You can make a combo breakfast with the following choices. You can choose one four-ounce yogurt, string cheese, egg, and an egg and cheese sandwich, bagel, cereal, muffin, and eight ounce milk. Choose one or two fresh fruit, fresh fruit, fruit cup, 100% four ounce juice, or choose one eight ounce milk choice. Seniors, the Big Y scholarship applications are available in the Career Center. Please stop by to pick one up. Application deadline is February 1st, 2016. Trust me, you're gonna need the scholarship. College <laughs> is expensive. If you're a senior who is planning on pursuing an education in medical health sciences, engineering, or vocational field, please pick up an application for a Weller Foundation Scholarship in Bee House Guidance. The application deadline is February 11, 2016. See Ms. McEnany with any questions. You'll need that scholarship too. Seniors, the Connecticut Bar Foundation James W. Cooper Fellows Quinton Johnstone 2015-16 Essay Contest. If you win and enter, the grand prize is $2,000 cash. Two runner-up prizes are $1,000 cash. And the essays are to be judged by federal and state court judges, law professors, and lawyers. The award ceremony will be had at the, held at the Connecticut Supreme Court. Volunteering community service opportunities are right anywhere you'd like to go after them. Community service opportunity on Saturday, November 7, 2015, there will be a cleanup day from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. at the Nichols Improvement Association ball fields and parking lot. You can volunteer as much time as you can during these, uh, those hours. Bring a lunch. Contact Dawn Wood for more information. Volunteer, oh shoot. Yeah. Swiss Army sale, volunteers needed. 
November 12th, 13th, 14th, and 15th. Students will be chosen on a first-come basis. If chosen, you, you will receive a written confirmation of your assigned date and time. Sign-up sheets can be found in the guidance offices. Please return them to Mr. Matthews' mailbox in B House office. If you have any questions, you can see Mr. Matthews in room B23. And now with sports. Julie Keckler. And now with sports with Julie Keckler. Welcome, Hello. Julie. Welcome. What? Cable <laughs> Manchester, Charlie T qualified for cross country state opening. Girls volleyball and field hockey qualify for FCAC playoffs. And girls and boys soccer, field hockey and volleyball qualified for <coughs> state playoffs. Thanks, Julie. No problem. And now Danny Hoffman with weather. <laughs> hey, Danny. Hey. Hi, how are you guys? Great, how are you? I'm good. Good. What's um, the weather looking like? The, all right, so it's sunny out. It's like July, but in November. And I wore this hat today because it's partly cloudy. <laughs> um, there's nothing in these cups. Yeah, that's about it. It's been weather. With Danny Hoffman. Danny Hoffman. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, that's my mic. <laughs> 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 Thank you, Trumbull High School. This is the Trumbull Talk, and have an eagle day.